Damn it, someone must have torn out the rest of the pages. Strange. I was in the attic and... Hmm, I'll show the diary to Emma. She might find it interesting. Honey, you won't believe what I found it. Hey, Emma? Can you hear me? Emma? I was calling you before, but you wouldn't even answer. Where have you been? I was snooping around the attic. I found this... The power is out, by the way. Diary... what A fuse must have blown. Be a darling, go to the basement, and fix it before it gets dark. This place needs a lot of work. The sooner we start, the better. I don't have to tell you that, do I? What's her problem? She sounded like I took a piss on her mother flower bed. I need a flashlight. It's so damn dark in the basement. Maybe I can find one in the attic. There's a lot of junk in there. This horse will haunt me in my dreams. I bet its chiming has startled many people. Where are the fuses? Strange, one's missing. Did someone take it out on purpose? Maybe there's a spare fuse in the shed by the house.
It looks very old. I wonder who played here. Uses here, of course. What the? F what is this? Where did all the blood come from? A shirt covered in blood. It looks fresh. How did it get here? Why would Emma bring my old stuff from the office here? Jesus! Emma, you scared the crap out of me. Okay, you can open the door. Emma? Honey? Something's not right. Maybe the localizer will show me just what's happened here. Wait, what did they say in training? Huh. If I remember correctly, this prototype device can be used to detect traces of a person's presence from the past. All I need is to be in a strong field of quantum particles, and with a little bit of luck and science, I'll be able to see a silhouette of the person who was here in a different time. I should follow the localizer. Green lines at the edge of the screen show the direction to go, and the numbers the distance to the nearby cloud.
I'll look for the signal source. When the green lines come together, it means I'm looking in the right direction. I just need to follow that way. This is the place. Now I need to use the pulse to show the cloud, and I need to scan it. The signal must be coming from this place. Now I just have to use the scanner on this cloud. found something. Someone has been here. It looks like he left the rest of the clothes here. All covered in blood. I'll try to find more traces. It doesn't look good. I have to find out what happened here. Fuse is missing, some clothes are lying all covered in blood, and a trace of a person near the shed. It's all looking very strange. Maybe it's all about the stress. On the other hand, I have to be certain that we're safe. I should use the pulse to make the quantum cloud visible, otherwise I won't see a thing. but I can't read anything. The interference is too strong. It must be caused by an anomaly nearby. I should neutralize it. here recently and used this rope. I'll try to find more traces. The localizer has detected a signal. That means another quantum cloud has been near. from here. Here, it hasn't been long. The trail leads through that gate. I'm gonna check it out. I clearly drag something heavy through that gate. Some 
planks are loose. I'll try to break them out. Blood hasn't dried yet. I'll follow its trail. Maybe someone needs help. Damn it! Closed. Just closed. It looks like something or someone is hanging in there. Is that... <laughs> Fuck! This thing scared the shit out of me. I'd better check what the localizers detected before I go in.
here. A hunting knife. Someone must have used it recently and tried to hide it there. I'll take it, just in case. Try to get inside. On this. This wasn't just some poacher, more like a fucking sadistic hunter. Wait, that beeping. It's as if it's coming from the inside. The animal is hung up on a rope. Maybe I can get up there and cut it down. I could use that crate to reach the ladder and climb up. This is sick. I think I'm gonna puke. What's all this equipment? And why was it in... Fuck, what if the Soviets sent someone to follow us? Well, there's the fuse. So the fucker who gutted the animal has also been in our house. In our basement. If this isn't a threat, then I don't know what is. At least I've got a goddamn fuse. Time to go to the basement and turn the power back on. I don't like this. Someone's butchered a deer and the evidence suggests that sick fuck has been in our house. I remember back in the day, some twisted kids in the area played with the occult, but I don't think this could have been them. Besides, the equipment that was inside it looked military grade. But clearly, the locals make new neighbors feel welcome. I just hope they don't mistake us for turkeys on Thanksgiving.
the power's back on, I guess. Hmm, interesting. Or maybe it's no big deal. Maybe I've just been reading too much Poe. Well, my job here is done. I better go back under Emma's thumb, considering her mood swing. And it's only the third month. What's it gonna be like by the ninth? Boom! Jesus, woman! <laughs> you want me to have a heart attack? Cool, huh? Wonder if some magician used to live here. Sure, Harry fucking Houdini. Maybe he's never gotten out of that hat. Actually, where did you find it? I just read about one like this. Upstairs. Now watch carefully. <laughs> if it's a rabbit, I want it for dinner and a stew. Ta-da! Clever. You think you can sugarcoat the work for me with magic? <laughs> where do we start? Darling, do I really have to remind you what the doctor said? Ugh, you've done it plenty of times already, but really, I don't have to sit idle all the time. Still, in your condition... It's not critical. I'm just pregnant, remember? But fine. If I can't help you, I'll pester you with questions. Have they called you from work yet? Mm, no. And did you give them our new number? Honey, it's the government. They even know the angle you're tilting your head at. <sighs> Gives me the creeps. Ever thought about doing something other than, you know, cryptanalysis? I mean, before you joined the CIA? Like what? Like, um, something that doesn't come with being responsible for millions of lives. Some job without all the spies, agents, and double agents lurking behind your back? Without the constant feeling that you can't trust anyone? Um, not really. Besides, I can trust you, right? What are you staring at? Can you move that piece of furniture? There's something behind it. regret putting that thing on my head. I wonder who that guy was. Maybe if we hang this in the bedroom, you'll come to us in our dreams and tell us everything. I'd hang you first. Okay, okay. Sorry, buddy, you're going to the basement. That's the proper place for gentlemen from the previous century. Hello? It's David. So, this is it, boss. This is the moment when you start to rush me and I start to sweat. Well, <laughs> I don't want to press you too much, but I haven't heard from you for a week now. So I thought, maybe he was killed by bears or wolves. I'd better call him. Because you're stuck in the middle of nowhere, right? <laughs> yeah, I'm stuck in every possible way. <sighs> you're not the only one. Three quarters of the team were assigned to work on the Russian woodpecker. And on top of that... Harold has vanished. Harold? The one who intercepted the telegrams. 
What happened? I don't know. Stress? He's been paranoid lately, seeing Soviets everywhere. Either he went nuts and did something stupid, or those Soviets did get him after all. Fuck! O on our soil? Well, they could be anywhere. And... I don't want to think he's playing both sides. To make it even worse, Bill and Mildred will shut down the project if we don't make a breakthrough in the next few weeks. I've got the documents from Janice with me. I'll get down to work. Good luck. And give my regards to your wife. I'll call you in a few days. And there goes my vacation. The cipher machine is in the office. I've wasted enough time already. First, let's take a look at the manual. Oh! I need to take the right cylinders from the table. Luckily, they're numbered. I need to remember that each cylinder goes into a specific position. I did something wrong. This isn't how it should be. No, it shouldn't be inserted like that. I'll check the manual again. I think it was point two. Okay, the first part's done. Now it's time to set the cogs.
Now I just have to set the right numbers using the knobs. Piece of cake. Now for the last step, the wires at the bottom. Right, now I just have to plug that in using the right order. That's it. Now I just need to enter the password. I have to be careful. If I click the wrong letters, I'll have to reset the cogs. Okay, it works. I can get down to it. What's this? It looks like a message encrypted with an enigma. Maybe with the right combination I'll be able to decipher it. Now how do I set it up? A Roman 5-3-S-T. This must be a clue for the encrypted message. What does it mean though? And how can I use it to set enigma up? Number 17 looks correct. I'll use that configuration and see if my hunch was right. Something is wrong. Configuration, maybe? I should take a closer look at the table or password.
trust no one but yourself. Sounds ominous. Who wrote this anyway? Now what? Check combinations 29 and 30. So? Still nothing. Fuck. This terrible crime shocked. Fuck. This looks like our house. The victim's throat was slashed? This is getting too fucked up. Seriously. God, how long has this been here? Is this... blood? Or just rust? Is this what I think it is? More notes from Nicholas. It hurts, so I must be alive. Damn it, I almost...